We've configured an SLC 505 processor's Ethernet channel by assigning an IP address and a subnet mask, and configured an Ethernet driver. We can establish communications between RS Logics 500 software and an SLC 505 processor over the Ethernet network. First, we'll download a project using an existing serial connection. From the Communications menu, we'll select System Communications. We'll make sure our processor is selected and click Download. We'll type Ethernet for the revision note and click OK. We're prompted to use the new project settings. Let's click Yes. And we'll click Yes to go online. We'll open the Channel Configuration dialog box and click the Channel 1 System tab to confirm that our IP address and subnet mask addresses are filled in. Next, we'll click Cancel. Now let's go offline so we can configure RS Logics 500 software to use the Ethernet communication driver we've set up. First, let's make sure that our SLC 505 processor and computer are properly connected via an Ethernet connection. Next, let's switch communication drivers in RS Logics 500 software. From the Tools menu, we'll select Options and click the System Communications tab. From the Drivers drop-down list, we'll select the Ethernet driver and click OK. The Ethernet driver is displayed on the online toolbar. Next, from the Communications menu, we'll select Who Active Go Online. In the Tree view, we'll click the Ethernet network and select the processor. Finally, we'll click OK. We're online with the processor over an Ethernet network. 